Hi guys. So now we are into the final stages of our robot. So in this video, we are making our robot follow a straight line or turn a particular angle by making use of the encoders. So as the first step, we rotate the wheel and find the encoder values at which it completes one revolution. So we do that for the front left motor as well as the back right motor where there are encoders attached and we find the encoder values required to complete one complete revolution and then use these values to find the difference between the uh, left side wheels and right side wheels so that we can make sure that there is no difference between the encoder ticks of both the wheel sides so that it always travels in a straight line and eliminate small trajectories that happen due to wheel friction or some other factors. So once again looking into the algorithm part we will be finding the encoder tick of the left side motors as well as the right side motors uh, subtracting them together to see the error and then using that error to adjust the PWM value so that we can control the speed of the motor which is rotating less and which is rotating more so that it always travels in a straight line. So in the next video we can see the robot moving in a straight line. So before going into the video let's see the setup we are using to make sure that the robot is moving in a straight line. So here we are making use of a measuring tape which measures up to 1 meters and we have the robot here. So we will be commanding the robot to move to a distance of 1 meter and we can see whether there is any deviation from the path using the tape. So let's see the demo in the next video.